are back here at Morningstar Senior Living. Today we're chatting with Heather. Heather, how was the discussion with your parents about moving here? Because a lot of younger adults have to have that talk with their parents and it can be uncomfortable, there can be some resistance. Yeah, it, it was hard. I, I, I think my, my father was more receptive about it. It was really hard for my mom. Just she loved to uh, upkeep her home and to have be taken away from that and her comfort zone, that was really hard. Um, but I explained to him, I said that for emergencies, it makes it quite difficult and I want to be there for them. And I felt like I couldn't be there for them to take care of their needs, having them live 50 miles away, even though that doesn't sound like a, a long ways when there's emergencies, it is. Oh, sure. And so they understood and we had them take a tour of Morning Star, and my dad is a social butterfly, and so he immediately fell in love. He's like, "Oh, there's all these activities to do. This is going to be fun." And uh, my mom, she really likes it here as well. And how have they adjusted? You know, they have adjusted really, really well. My mom, it took a little bit longer because she went from a big home to an apartment. Um, but she loves the, the warmth of the apartment. She's made it her own home. She really enjoys the, the neighbors. She has great neighbors, mom, mom and dad do, so it makes it nice. That's one of the things about Morningstar that people may not know is that the level of care can vary. Like, yeah. like your parents have their own apartment and, uh, and they can go from that to where they're living somewhat independently. That's right to complete 100% care, right? That's right. It spans, it's across the spectrum. Absolutely, and that was something that was really important to, to me, as well as my sisters, is that we could find a community that could provide that care if needed. And, you know, as with health concerns and as you get older, sometimes that care needs to be increased. And so um, if they needed to go to assisted living, you know, there is that option. And now they have their daughter working right where they live. That's right. So it turned into a place for them to live and a job for you. That's right. <laughs> well, please tell them hi for us. I sure will. And it's been nice chatting with you, You Heather. too, Nate. Thank you. Thank you.